Dear viewers, welcome to our channel. It is reported that Grok, a US artificial intelligence startup, has launched an inference chip for large scale cloud models. This chip, utilizing the new Tensor Streaming Architecture, TSA, and high bandwidth SRAM, boosts inference speed for large models by over 10 times, surpassing even NVIDIA's GPU. Grok's LPU chip far outperforms NVIDIA GPU in inference speed while consuming only one-tenth of the power, achieving a 100-fold increase in cost-effectiveness. With its large-capacity SIM memory, it provides ultra-high bandwidth and low latency, suitable for scenarios with smaller models and frequent data access needs. Is this true? The question arises. Grok LPU chip's replacement of DRAM memory with large-capacity SIM has improved inference speed and reduced energy consumption, but has also increased area and cost. In future development, how to balance the increase in SIM memory capacity with factors such as area, cost, and power consumption? Although Grok LPU chip's performance exceeds that of NVIDIA GPU in certain aspects, running large models requires more chips which may increase deployment costs. In this case, how can Grok LPU chip gain advantages in the market competition and attract more users? If the uniqueness of Grok LPU chip lies in its adoption of SIM memory and TSA architecture, different from traditional GPUs, does this unique design mean that Grok LPU chip can achieve better performance in specific fields? And how to cope with competition from other vendors? AI startup Grok has launched its latest large-scale inference chip, the LPU. Developed by the original Google TPU team, this chip is a dedicated ASIC chip designed specifically for large-scale inference. Currently, the inference API based on Grok chip has begun to be open to external users, and developers can apply for trials on the company's official website or experience for free on the PO platform. Impressively, the Grok LPU chip performs excellently in AI inference speed. Taking the question-answering scenario as an example, using the Llama 70B model, users can almost instantaneously obtain answers from asking questions, with a first word output delay of only 0.2 seconds, and over 500 words generated in approximately one second. In comparison, ChatGPT takes nearly 10 seconds to generate the same amount of content. In terms of throughput indicators, Grok's data shows that its LPU's performance leads by about 10 times compared to industry-leading products, far exceeding inference products based on NVIDIA GPUs. The Grok LPU chip is mainly designed for large-scale inference scenarios, especially performing well in scenarios with a large number of concurrent user accesses. Its excellent inference speed also means lower inference costs. From Grok's disclosed inference prices, its prices are already at the lowest level in the industry, with the Mixtral 8x7B Mo model priced about four times cheaper than GPT 3.5. According to reports, Grok LPU's inference speed is 10 times faster than NVIDIA GPUs, while costs are reduced by one-tenth, resulting in a 100-fold increase in cost effectiveness. It can be said that it meets user demands in both speed and cost. However, regarding its high single card price, many may wonder how Grok achieves leading inference prices at such high prices. Taking the Llama 70B as an example, running this large model requires approximately 256 Grok LPU cards, equivalent to four server racks, with each rack capable of accommodating 64 LPU cards. In comparison, an 8 card H100 GPU server can also effectively run this model. But in terms of hardware costs, Grok LPU servers are far more expensive than NVIDIA servers. Grok LPU chips face challenges in area, cost, and power consumption in practical applications. First, as electronic devices continue to evolve, chip area becomes an important consideration. To address this issue, designers can use advanced manufacturing techniques, such as smaller feature sizes and higher integration to achieve chip miniaturization. Second, cost is a factor that cannot be ignored in the manufacturing process. By optimizing design and using efficient manufacturing processes, production costs can be reduced. In addition, power consumption is also an important consideration 
especially in the field of mobile devices. To reduce power consumption, designers can use low-power design methods, such as dynamic voltage adjustment and power management systems. In summary, through detailed analysis of the challenges faced by Grok LPU chips in area, cost, and power consumption, and proposing corresponding solutions, chip miniaturization, low cost, and low power consumption can be achieved while maintaining high performance. Grok LPU chips, as emerging AI hardware devices, are highly concerned about their competitive strategies and development prospects in the future market. Firstly, cooperation with other AI hardware vendors is one of its important competitive strategies. Through close cooperation with partners, Grok LPU chips can fully utilize the technical advantages and complementary resources of all parties to jointly promote product innovation and development. In addition, optimizing product performance to meet the needs of different customers is also a key strategy for Grok LPU chips. With the continuous advancement of artificial intelligence technology, customer demands for AI hardware are becoming increasingly diversified. Therefore, Grok LPU chips need to continuously improve their performance and functionality to meet the needs of different fields and applications. In the market, Grok LPU chips have broad potential application areas and development prospects. Firstly, in the field of intelligent transportation, Grok LPU chips can support intelligent optimization of traffic signals and intelligent scheduling of traffic flow. Through powerful computing capabilities and efficient algorithms, improving road traffic efficiency and reducing traffic congestion and accident rates. Secondly, in the medical and health field, Grok LPU chips can be applied to medical imaging diagnosis, intelligent assistance in diagnosis and treatment, and other aspects, providing more accurate and efficient medical services. In addition, Grok LPU chips can also play an important role in smart homes, industrial automation, and other fields improving quality of life and production efficiency. Overall, Grok LPU chips have good competitive strategies and development prospects in the future market. Through cooperation with other AI hardware vendors, optimizing product performance to meet different customer needs, etc., Grok LPU chips will be able to continuously enhance their competitiveness and market share. Meanwhile, applications in intelligent transportation, medical and health, smart homes, and other fields provide broad development space for Grok LPU chips. It is believed that with the passage of time and technological progress, Grok LPU chips will stand out in the market and become an important participant and leader in the field of AI hardware. Finally, let me summarize for readers, hoping you have gained something, inspiration and reflection. In the current technological development, finding a balance between technology and economics has become an important issue especially in the application of Grok LPU chips. How to ensure cost-effectiveness while maintaining technological innovation is a key issue. We need to deeply analyze the relationship between technological investment and economic returns, find a balance point, and make Grok LPU chips more widely applied and better accepted in the market. To achieve this goal, we can start from two aspects. First, in terms of technological innovation, we need to maintain continuous research and development, constantly improve the performance and functionality of Grok LPU chips. By introducing new technologies and algorithms, we can enhance the chip's computing power and efficiency, thereby enhancing its application capabilities in various fields. At the same time, we also need to pay attention to changes in market demand and timely adjust the direction and focus of technological research and development to meet the changing needs of users. Second, in terms of economic benefits, we need to focus on cost control and resource optimization. By reducing the cost of chip manufacturing and improving production efficiency, we can make Grok LPU chips more competitive in price, attracting more users to adopt them. In addition, we can strengthen cooperation with partners, share resources and technologies, and reduce research and production costs. Through reasonable resource allocation and cooperation models, win-win situations of technology and economy can be achieved. In summary, to find a balance point between technology and economy to achieve wider application, we need to make efforts in both technological innovation and economic benefits. 
Only in this way can Grok LPU chips stand undefeated in the market competition and bring better experience and value to users. That's it for today's video. Stay tuned for the next exciting content. Bye-bye.